this video let me show you the reports and the statistics where you can see your buyer's data as well as your opt-in data all right so if you want to see your buyer's data what you need to do is you need to click on the edit button of your product that you have created so this is the test product that we created and you need to go to the statistics all right and in the statistics you are going to find all the uh, buyer's data that you have so all the latest data is going to come below all right so uh, uh, if, if you watched one of the videos in which I showed the set rule setting so I just did the payment for this particular payment particular product using this particular email ID and uh, you know this is I, I have the buyers data right over here you know the email ID is here the name is here and the phone number is here I mean the test phone number that I added so that is here it also showed me the payment gateway that I used right so in case you have multiple payment gateways attached to a checkout button so it will show the payment gateway that was being used and uh, some of the other settings some of the other details which if if in case you have added to the checkout page it will be shown right over here right so as of now in the current checkout page we don't have any other data so that is not visible but if you will add more things to a checkout page let's say address um, let's say uh, city zip code anything anything so all of that data will start appearing right over here you know in the in the form of the columns so that is something that will be appearing over here so it over here it will show you all the data and in case you want to export the data you can click over here and it will be exporting the data for you all right that's uh, the the place where you can see your buyer's data in the statistics when it comes to seeing your opt-in data uh, what you need to do is you need to let's say I just made this test page I mean I just selected this template for the test page let me click on edit um, let's say let me open sarabitnaga.com and over here I have added the opt-in form let me click on this and in the opt-in form let me add it uh, let me add on submit go to sarabitnaga.com maybe in this particular video that is fine in this, this particular video window that is fine uh, let me click on publish okay so now when this is done let's suppose somebody uh, subscribes to you right over here let's say I subscribe with this email ID so as by the instructions I have gone to the thank you page right that is done uh, but more importantly let me go back to the page outside and over here I will go to the reports okay and you can see that my name is there and my email id is there so these were the two things that i have add, added to the form and both of these uh, details are available right over here right so that's how you will get your opt-in data i mean if you will have more fields in your uh, opt-in page let's say you know phone number address and uh, any any such uh, any more data so that is also something that will be visible right over here and then what you can simply do is you can export the data just in case you want to do that right so this is this is where you can play around with the things and this is where uh, you know you will be getting all your data